William Osmond me is, and today we're going to do a heavily requested laser experiment. Laser cutting ice. 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 The ice. The ice. 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 <sighs> We need to be careful not to fill the container too high because the water will expand when it freezes and it'll overflow. Let's cut some water while we wait, wait for the ice to dry. Right in a smelter 9000 is my home built laser cutter of Doom Death. <laughs> We want to turn the air on a little bit to keep steam from coming up and getting in the cutting head and making weird things happen. Let's just do a test with full power. Now we're going to try a drop of water. <laughs> it instantly vaporizes. Oh, that's crazy. It like formed a... Or is that the air doing that? I don't really know, I can't tell. It like doesn't even care that the water's there. All right, let's check on the ice. Oh, okay. Did not prepare. Ah, it's so cold. <laughs> the ice isn't gonna fit, so we need to take the uh, cutting table off to get a couple more inches. Nice to meet you. This is big block of ice and we're just gonna shoot straight into it. Two, one. That was really cool. Oh wow, that went right through. Trying to keep the ice juice away from me. Tastes like tap water. 150. Nice. That's a really deep cut. I don't know what to do now. Do I eat it? It's like the world's blandest popsicle. You wanna try it, Cameron? <laughs> <laughs> so far, this seems like a completely reasonable way to cut ice. Oh, that's uh, that's really tall. Damn, that is brutal. It has no problems. It just goes right through. So that's a clean cut too. That's weird. You can see like these streaks in the ice. Right, let's cut this into cubes. Ah! Uh, uh, ah! Now let's cut the remainder of the cube. Oops, one second guys. Let's wash it off really quick to get rid of the sawdust. Hey, where's that nice drink glass? Um, How about milk on the rocks? Yeah? Ooh, that looks really gross. <laughs> it's got like a green tinge to it. Mmm. Nothing. Now let's cut a shape out. Awesome, now we just need a cat. We probably should have done this experiment first, but uh, let's do laser drill without the lens. I mean, it is working, but that's pretty slow. I was hoping we'd be able to like go right through it. Yeah, maybe laser drill isn't gonna work. I think what's happening right now is it's melting the ice, which is turning into water, which is filling up the hole, and then the laser is just hitting the, the melted water. Let's do a quick demonstration to show you what's actually hitting the ice right now. We're gonna put a piece of cardboard in the path of the beam, and I'm gonna fire the laser. <laughs> So it's enough light to instantaneously light the cardboard on fire. Well, laser drilling didn't work so well, but laser cutting I think works really well on ice. Now let me come down and we'll give away some of the laser record CDs we cut on last week's video. Oh God, this works way better. Oh, oh.
They might be a little bit scratched. <laughs> Sorry. I have chosen 10 people. There's a lot of a lot of comments, but Banana Jesus, Daniel Jimenez, 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 Jacob Ward, CT Jet 99, Spencer Walsh, Erwin Jubert, Jobert, Jubert, ASD, 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 AS497, uh, Angelo Adu Aduki, Aducci, Aduki. Uh, game witness or whiteness and then x9 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 what creative usernames you guys have come up with so uh, send me a message that's it see you next time <laughs> he's like there's other people here <laughs>